11. 200 people were rescued this morning after getting stuck in a mudslide on the westbound 58 just east of Tehachapi. Good evening, I'm Grecia Aguilar. And I'm James Johnson. Tim Callahan has the night off. Crews are still working to clear the roadway, but it has been closed indefinitely. 23 ABC's Jessica Harrington is live from Highway 58 with the latest details on the road closure. Jessica. James, as you can see behind me, crews are working around the clock to try and get these roads reopened, but so far there is no end in sight. A lot of rain and then uh, the side of the mountain, the dirt just started coming down and the mud just hit us. Today, the aftermath of a downpour 24 hours ago. Cars still buried and crews still working. No, this doesn't usually happen. This is something you expect to see back east where they have big floods, where the rivers overrun, things like that. Not through here, not on a major highway like this. More than 200 people rescued from their vehicles this morning and taken by bus to emergency shelters. We will call you uh, when your car is out, okay? Left behind, trucks buried in five to seven feet of mud, and the sheriff's department meticulously checking the ground, marking off each spot as they go, trying to see if anything is buried underneath. You know, our concern is a motorcyclist, perhaps, smaller vehicles, trucks, no problem, but smaller vehicles. Some truck drivers staying with their vehicles, recounting what they went through. Cars swim by my truck. Dozens of cars still buried and crews working around the clock to move them out and get the road cleared, leaving many to wonder when exactly they can get back on the road. I hope we don't get another rain tonight because they, they, they inspect another rain tonight, so hopefully we can get out of here before that. As of now, officials say the road closure is indefinite, and we just heard from the CHP that they are clearing everyone out of the area so that the construction workers can continue to do their job and get these roads open as soon as possible. Also, crews are saying that they hope that the rain doesn't come and ruin any of the work they've already done so far. Reporting live near Tehachapi, Jessica Harrington, 23 ABC.